Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello, welcome to video four. What is material? The view size node. I fired up a quick little example. Let's go ahead and take a look at this. So our view size node. It's pretty simple. Basically, it's going to give us a 2D vector giving us the size of the current view in pixels. Basically, what that means is our current view is going to be our viewport or game screen or window size. Now, in order to see this in action, what we're going to need to do is play this in a new window so I can go and resize it. Let's stop that and actually look at what I'm doing here first. What I'm doing here is I'm basically getting our R value, which is our X, and comparing it to the number 1000. If it's a 1000 or less, it's going to be one color. And if it's a 1000 or more, it's going to be another color. Basically, if our X is greater than a 1000, we're going to color our cube one color. And if it's less than a 1000, we're going to color it another. To see this in use, I played a new window. And we can see here, let's go ahead and maximize this. And we're going to see our cube is orange. Now, if I was to pull this back to window size, it's still orange. My window is 1920 by 1080. So 1920 is what we care about. And this window itself, I think, is running around 1280. If we were to slowly resize this, and I keep in mind it won't do it in real time, and eventually hit our 1000 mark, it's going to change to white. Right there. So this is now under 1000 in terms of the width. And it doesn't matter how much I resize it to, if it's under 1000, it's going to do one portion of my command, which is color it white. If it's over a thousand, it's going to color it orange. And that's it. That's what our view size node is for. It tells you the size of the view, and then you can do whatever you want appropriately with it. So in this case, if it's full screen, it'll give me, you know, 1920 by 1080, or if it's smaller than that, it'll give me something else. You could use it maybe if your player was playing at a smaller resolution. Maybe you want to downsample some of the textures so they're not taking up as much memory or space. Or, for example, they're on a higher resolution, maybe you want to give them some higher resolution textures. So, that's it. That is what our view size node is. It gives you back the X and Y values of our current view. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them below.